What is up, Obscure Mic people? It's Bart coming back at you with a microphone that roughly runs about $35. It's the one audio, one audio, something like that. One, I think, I want to say one audio. I need to start asking, you know, what how they pronounce the names of their mics. But this is from a, uh, generally a headphone company. I'm sure you've all heard of one audio on uh, the headphones. Amazon, a lot of one audio headphones on there. And they did send me over a pair, and I will review those and check those out on Obscure Tech, which is my uh, my other venture that I've kind of recently started. I would love if you all subscribed, especially just to get me to that monetizing monetizing. <laughs> Help me get monetizable. Monetized. Montenegros. Monte Monte Cristo. Mon Monte Crisco. Monte Cri I am from Southern Ohio. There, there is reasons. There is reasons. There are reasons why I can't talk. And it's, I grew up, I can't talk at all. I grew up, still growing up, around hilljacks. If you haven't heard that word, it's what I like to call the, the people of, the, their, uh, the, they have necks of red. Necks of red. There goes one of them now. <laughs> driving a driving a big old dump truck full of trump flags anyways <laughs> i'm here all night folks i'm here all night so one audio sent me over this dynamic handheld microphone this will probably be the next video i release just because i entertained myself and I, I had no plans of doing this is the next one but that's what i'm gonna do uh one audio did send me this microphone free of charge they didn't ask me to say anything special about it they said hey bark and i said hey one audio and he said check out this mic and i said that's what i do that's what i enjoy doing so let's do it send it on over i'll touch it and rub on it and stuff and talk into it and whisper sweet nothings into its ear and we'll see how that goes so here it is i've got the mic and uh I, i'll show you the mic here oh yeah it, it's a handheld you know it's a nice handheld mic got a good build quality uh, in the box, I'll show you what comes in there. I'm not going to do a separate unboxing video. Like some things I will, some I won't. Uh, you know, standard mic clip uh, with a 5H, 3H inch thread adapter. Uh, it does also come with a very long uh, XLR to three quarter inch jack cable. Uh, I don't use those much, to be honest with you. And it does also come with some uh, documentation. So there you go. One audio. Most important thing here is the mic, but it is always a it is always a welcome thing when they send any kind of cable, any kind of cord, anything like that, and a clip, because this thing uh, you might need the clip because the handling noise. You might need the clip because the handling noise is there. It's not crazy bad, but it. It's there. You got to keep a tight grip on it. That's what she said. If you don't want any handling noise, but I will say, uh, this microphone, even though it doesn't look like anything different from the norm, it's a, it's got a nice shape to it that, uh, is good in the hand. Feels really good just to hold. That's also what she said. The grill, nice grill, no give hard as a rock, all black. I appreciate that. And, uh, it is very, it is nice and clear. I will give it that. It is just the tiniest bit harsh up top, but not anything crazy. Overall, I think it's a very clear and uh, just present microphone right in your face. So let's do some uh, tests on it real quick. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled pineapple pizza. Oh, God, that, that plosive of rejection is not good. It, 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 it's not good. It's not good. Let's get a Wendy here. I got a Wendy. That'll work. Uh, Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza. Let's throw this on there real quick. Not all the way. Let's do a little tech raccoon thing. What's up, tech raccoon, my brother? Hopefully you still watch. Uh, he, he, you know, I do this too, and I never made a video about it, but he made a video about just taking your windscreen and making sure it's not right against the capsule, leaving a gap in there, which I've talked about before, but that will help your plosives. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza. Let's go. Let's tech raccoon it a little more. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza. Let's do it a little more. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza. See, the, the further you get that off there, the better it is. We'll just slap it on there. Peter Piper, Peter Piper, Peter Piper. All right. Tell you what else is nice about this. On off switch. No. 
I like it on off switch. And this one is it doesn't protrude from the body, so it would be extremely hard to accidentally turn off. So yeah, that's pretty solid. More tests. When you get right on top of the one audio on fifty five, this is what it sounds like when you're right on top of the one audio on audio one audio. I'm from Southern Ohio. When you're right on top, this is what it sounds like. Now let's go ahead and take the microphone and go 90 degrees off axis rejection. Pretty good. 180 degrees off axis rejection. 90 again. And then slowly back around to the front of the microphone. What's this say? Is this cardioid? Yes, yeah, it says cardioid, but that's that's pretty strong. That's pretty strong cardioid performance right there. Uh, let me say I it is just a little bit overly bright. But as far as like the overall sound profile goes, I think this would make a really good cheap podcasting mic. You're just going to want a windscreen or always looking around for stuff like where's my mount with the windy or the screen on the end of it. You're going to need something for the plosive protection. Um, otherwise, I think it's a pretty solid buy. It's it is crispy and bright. But I mean, if you put a nice big old fat foam windscreen on there, you're not going to have any problems with that. And the big old fat foam windscreen, let's get a bigger one, is really going to take the uh, the top off of that, that microphone there. So it's a lot smoother here with this big old fat windy. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza and it curbs the plosive. So don't underestimate a good windscreen, especially if you're looking to get up and going fairly cheap because this here just totally changed this is a thick one by the way but this really tamed down the top end as you can see now that top end this really tamed down the top end so this is a, a mic that's highly colorable by a foam windscreen especially a nice big thick one see now it's just a lot yeah that's that that's helpful pressing all the way on and it's uh, still very helpful man you can just change everything a little bit more off there back to full on a little bit more off back to on sorry having a lot of fun with this today so yeah anyways i i think this is a it's not very offensive that top end is crispy but that is fixable so if you're looking for a nice cheap mic one audio sent this one over i think i think it's pretty solid honestly i think the more i talk on it the more i like it so i'm gonna shut up and move on but one audio did send it over thank you guys for sending it over Look out for the uh, headphone review of the headphones they sent over, which has some pretty cool features. That'll be on Obscure Tech, not Obscure Mics. But the On 55 is out of here. Bark is out of here. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.